Hi there. I wanted to show you a great way to visualize your data from GA4 um, away from the GA4 UI in, into something like what this is, which is Google Looker Studio. So Google Looker Studio is Google's reporting platform, essentially. It's completely free, um, and it offers you the ability to visualize really any data um, within here using quite a lot of different reporting visualization options. Um, so you can very easily pull, pull the, and completely free, pull this from your GA4 property into Google Looker Studio. So you would just essentially go to Google uh, Looker Studio's main homepage, you know, click create a report. Um, and then once you're in here, it's gonna ask you to add a data source. You would connect it to your GA4 property as long as you're signed in to the same property uh, or same account that you have access to your GA4 property, <clears throat> you can add this. You can see that my data source is granular. Um, this just auto creates, but you can insert, let's say, let's um, insert time series chart. And our time series chart is gonna be date and we're gonna do sessions. But we also wanna do engage sessions. So you can do this. Um, you can add really anything else. Um, you know, let's do a table, quick table of date and then source and medium, or um, of source and medium, and then sessions um, or you know, conversions. So you can see that, you know, this table, this data is tableized in here. You can also do a lot of cute, cool things um, like uh, having um, filtering. So you can, you know, or filter the date. So this is date, but um, you can do source and medium. So you can have a value. So if you want it to be certain that a uh, certain value, you can do um, date range control. You can do data control, which is really for GA4. But you can do one of the greatest things I think is a drop down. Um, so essentially, if you wanted this entire report to be filtered to a certain source and medium, you could have this, and then pick your source and medium. And then you can see here, it's going to reflect that in the data. Um, so it gives your team a great way to just organize the data that is in uh, GA4. Um, there's a lot that you can do within this. Um, you know, you can add a lot of filtering, you can add images, you can add text. Um, there's, yeah, so much pivot tables. A lot of the things that you would do in Excel, um, gauges, you know, waterfall, um, you know, bubble map. Really whatever you'd like. So you can, you know, filter by location, change this, or filter by country or region, you know, zoom in. Um, and then, you know, customize your, you know, size to be anything you'd like. You know, so you can see where we have the most sessions and allow people to kind of, so there's a lot because Google Access is their own API for Google Maps. So this is a great thing to build um, and not just, you know, there's not just kind of like pure data. Um, you know, you can visit, you can add, you know, or you can design it essentially to be whatever you like. Um, you know, this, You can add um, text. So, you know, granular marketing report. Obviously, it needs some design help, but you know, something easy like that. Um, and once you're in there, you can also add a date range. 
So, you know, that's been, that was 10 seconds for me to add this. And you already have, you know, some sense of a clear marketing report. All you have to do is get your data in there. Um, but look how easy it was to kind of add that and organize it. There's a lot you can do with, with background color. Um, you know, if I go in here and add a table, use your style tab, you know, you can, uh, you know, wrap the text, you can add different, you know, column headers or uh, table colors, you know, whatever you'd like. Um, you can format the text so it's defined left or right uh, or center, you know, you can add the background, whatever you'd like, really. Um, so this is the best way, I think, to work with the data outside of GA4 or work with the data in general, in or out. Um, so I would definitely use this free tool, port your data from GA4 into Looker and use this to visualize the data that you want. Um, don't use, uh, or I don't recommend using the Explore tab. The Snapshot tab is great um, if you know you want to do it within uh, the UA uh, or the UI, but I really think Looker Studio is your best bet. There's so many different dimensions that you can pick from um, to, to really visualize the data. So definitely take a look at, at using this. Um, and uh, I think it's going to add a lot of benefit to your reporting. Hope this helps. 